live in today on Ark Survival Evolved. I'm gonna be building a fish tank because, you know, I need one and I'll probably show off why I need one when I finish building it, you know, so look forward to that because awesome surprises and stuff, but I actually started building it already and I did like uh, to record me building it, I thought that might be boring, but then it just popped into my mind like, hey, I should probably record this, so yeah, this is what I have so far and uh, yeah, that's, it's kind of like Cass's because this is actually a pretty easy way to uh, build a shark tank, I guess as opposed to like putting all this stuff, uh, fence foundations at the bottom and like walling your way up and you can just kind of pillar up, I mean things can swim through the uh, in, in between the pillars but I mean I plan on fixing that and uh, yeah I'll, I'll add in another dino gate cause one, one behemoth isn't gonna cut it in, oh hi dolphin sniffing the ground that's weird you're a weird dolphin <laughs> but anyways I uh I'm gonna probably go out to this rock I think uh yeah that that seems like a good good place to stop but uh I'll be back when I am finished so guys I have finished my dino gate uh, or not dino gate, uh, shark pen, and, uh, yeah, it's, it's okay, I guess, I mean, uh, but anyways, the reason why I needed it, yeah, is those two guys down there, I didn't want to, you know, take up Cass's face in her shark pen, so I just went ahead and built my own, and yeah, I kinda, I kinda got lazy at the end, so I just opted for coming in and kinda going a little diagonal, I guess, but uh, I'll probably change that up a little bit. <laughs> but yeah, we kinda went crazy and tamed up a bunch of plesiosaurs, though, a few days back, and yeah, I'm just now building a shark tank for them, so... Yeah, I'm I'm a great procrastinator. Probably one of the best. I don't know. It's uh it's to be determined. <laughs> but uh shoot. Well uh yeah, that's that's about all I wanted to do today. Uh I think I have a few more things and then I'm I'm probably gonna call it an episode, but uh, I have one thing that I'm planning to do next episode, and that is to kind of expand my yard and probably talk to Cass about uh, doing something in between our yards, because, you know, why not, and collab, I guess, but... You know, as you can see, my dinos are all bunched up and I haven't organized them because, well, there's really no point because they're just gonna get all bunched up again because things attack either side of my base. So, you know, regardless of what I do, I'm, they're gonna bunch up. So I'm just gonna expand the yard and, you know, so they can like not be by the wall and hopefully not aggro things and uh yeah i'll have to talk to Cass about it but uh the next order of business if you can't see in the distance are those two birds down there now chris who you know is a little crazy decided to breed just a bunch of quetzals at once because he is in love with quetzals and I mean really who isn't but uh, he bred mine and his and he got twins and uh, I was originally only going to get the male 
but uh, yeah, I got both of them because he didn't want to separate them, and uh, yeah, which is cool for me. That makes metal gathering so much easier. But uh, yeah, that's. I think they have identical stats. Uh, mm, 2100 health, 1425 stamps, uh, two unimportant stats, uh, 967 weight, decent melee damage and decent movement speed. So, yeah, I haven't leveled them anymore. Let's see how the girl's doing. So they look about the same. I think the only difference may be their food, which I mean is such a waste. Such a waste of natural levels when they they put them into their food. But yeah, so I got two more quetzals which will actually make turning my base all metal, which I don't think I've showed off what I've done so far. I mean, I got the uh, I got most of the of the walls and the ceilings in this room, and I'm about done with this room. I'm I'm really having kind of a kick in myself, wanting to just tear it all down and rebuild it <laughs> because like some of the snap points are a little weird and uh, but uh, yeah, I think that's a about it uh, I covered my tank I covered my Quetzal twins awesome I covered a little bit about my base and you know what I kind of want to do in the future so I think that's uh, that's gonna do it for me hmm oh wait hold on I have, I have an idea of how to end this give me a second Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> Please enjoy my silence. No, uh, we're gonna we're gonna end this episode off in front of the twins, cause they're awesome. So far, they have been just awesome. But uh, yeah, I think that's gonna do it for me. And uh, remember, with great power comes great responsibility. I'm Old Dills. And I'll see you guys later.